Team, do you guys think will win the big game? Super Bowl? Patriots. Yeah, Super Bowl. Rams. Rams. I think the Rams. Yeah. I think the Rams. It's the Patriots all day. That's your opinion. My opinion is the Rams, though. I'm looking at this way experience. The Patriots have been in five Super Bowls. The Rams have, haven't been in the Super Bowl for like 20 years. So, Patriots. Oh. Okay. Well, that's a lot of This is the Live and Five Show. I'm Maya. <laughs> and I'm Sean. Would you join a group that provides volunteer opportunities for leadership and teams? A polar vortex is causing chaos and blazing through the Midwest. This abnormal cold storm will be coming up in our world news. Well, it's time to talk about halftime. Half so stay tuned to find out after our halftime to get the scoop. Talk about the Super Bowl Sunday, baseball, and more to come on sports. All this and more right after the break. I am Tets Off California. I am Tets Off California. We are Tets Off California. I am Tets Off California. I am Tets Off California. Water. Yum. Water. Live in five show. Water. Get it now. Water. Room 205. Water. Only one dollar. Water. Water. Yum. Water. Yum. Water. 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 We're back. Now it's time to check out what's going on around campus. Hey, and I, what are you doing Friday after school? Probably read a book like I always do. <sighs> well, not anymore. On Friday, you're coming with me to the library. Why? Well... On every week, Friday after school at 1.15, you can go to the library and watch a Marvel movie. Did I hear a Marvel movie? Yes, you did. Well, every Friday starting at 1.15 is the Marvel movie. Remember, you need a permission slip from the library. Bye. Hey, and I, what are you doing? Hey guys, I'm Alvy. I'm from the Live and Five show, and tonight PTSA is holding a fundraiser at Chick Fil A. Let's see what's going on. Going for the Tesla. Uh, I think it's going great. Chick Fil A creates a great opportunity for schools to come in and fundraise money, uh, so it can benefit students. And it goes directly back into the community, and it helps out people who want to get great food. They can enjoy the food while they're here, and then they also can give back to their students. How are you enjoying your meal so far? It is so good in here. Chick-fil-A is the best restaurant in here. TSA does so much more events at Tesla and outside of Tesla. But for now, this is Elvi from the Live and Five Show. I'll see you next time. Are you a 7th grader interested in joining ASB this semester? Applications are now available in room 305. There, there will be an informational meeting at lunch next Wednesday, February 6th. Applications are due Friday, February 8th. See Mrs. Lopez in room 305 if you have any questions. That wraps it up for the Tets Off Play Play Play. Stay tuned. We'll be back before you can remember what the community story was called.
Welcome back. Time to get into today's hot topics. In our community, there are amazing ways for us young teens to impact our world. One of our Live and Vibe reporters will be checking in with us to tell you more about Volt. Hey guys, Maya here with another story for you. In my community, I have a program called Volt. Volt stands for Volunteer Opportunities for Leadership and Teens. This program is only for the ages 13 to 18 years old. Let's find out what other students our age have to say. I think I would because it grows connections throughout my community and so many more. Do you think this will benefit um, the volunteer rate in Cerritos? I think it would because you're helping people that you don't even know, but as time goes on, they can help you and it just, it's happy. Volt is a great opportunity for teens to get involved in the community and make new friends. If you're a member, you have the opportunity to sign up as a volunteer for activities ran by the city, such as gym programs, park programs, youth sports, special events, and more. Do you think the Volt program would accelerate the number of volunteers in Cerritos, and why? Yes, because the teens that are in the program are encouraging others to join and help out, making the chances of others joining higher. First Tuesday of every month at 5 p.m. in the Buena Park, Com Buena Park Community Center on 6,688 6, Beach Boulevard. After looking this up, I became more interested and willing to sign up and become a member. As always, I'm Samaya Ayala for the Live and Five show, and I'll see you next time. Sean Eli will be taking us for, to for today's action reaction segment. So here at Chico's Pizza for our next episode of Eli Eats in Linwood, California. And this is a staple here in Linwood. Everyone loves to come here, including the mayor. And I'm really excited to try it for this amazing pizza. It's very special for many reasons, and we'll find out why in our next episode of Eli Eats. I'm here with the owner, Juan, of Chico's Pizzas. And the reason we came over here is because this has been a staple in Linwood for everyone, including the mayor, Jose Solache. And so we wanted to ask you a couple of questions on how you got here. So when did you start Chico's Pizza? Chico's Pizza started in 1963, and I've been working here since 1990. Do you get a lot of business here all the time? Yes. And yes. What's your favorite thing to make? Pizzas. The pepperoni or? The Chico's combination. And what's in the Chico's combination? Salami, pepperoni, mushrooms, olives, oh. sausage, and cheese. Okay. Well, thank you so much for letting me interview you. Whenever you want to come and make some pizzas, let me know. <laughs> I'm here in the kitchen of Chico's Pizza, and I think I'm about to make a pizza myself, and I'm really excited to do that because um, I've been here a couple of times, but I've never really done anything like that, so I'm really excited to try this. Okay, first we get the board, and we put cornmeal, and then we pick the size of the pizza that we're going to make. Then we put the pizza sauce all over, then we add cheese, and then we add the toppings that the customer wants. And after we're done, we put it in the oven for about five to seven minutes. Yeah. 